and welcome back to my channel. Whew, summer is here and it is warm, but I am enjoying the sunshine and I want to continue to film outside as much as I can. In today's video, I want to talk about the top five money wasters and things that we tend to spend a little bit more money on in the summer that we don't technically need to, but we just kind of, because you know it's the summer and we want to. Anyway, number one. Number one isn't really something that you spend money on, it's kind of something that you're forced to spend money on, and it's speeding tickets. I never thought of this as a summer money waster, but then I looked at the records in the United States. People like to go out and drive because they're enjoying the summer weather. Sometimes they're showing off their new car to their friends, and they go a little bit fast. Do you guys know that the highest season of parking tickets is the summer? The highest number of sales brought in from tickets and people paying them is between June and September summer. You would think it would be somewhere around like New Year's or big holidays where people are drinking. Fourth of July, I guess you are drinking. But tickets, speeding tickets, they will get you. Don't waste your money on it. Don't follow my old high school motto, no cop, no stop. Number two on the top money wasters is buying ice cream from retail shops. And I know I'm just as guilty as anybody else because I love to go to Graders and Jenny's and get all that amazing ice cream. And then I go to the grocery store and they have ice cream there for a tenth of what I paid for it. And they're like the big cartons, like when Kroger has the 10 for 10 sale and I went out and paid $5 for a small scoop and a waffle cone and I'm like, really? Number three is cable. And I know I've talked about this sometimes in my other budgeting videos that cable is something that we can cut and save money on. But I've heard some people say, well, my kids are home for the summer and on days where it's too hot to go out, I wanna give them the option to watch cable, which is fine. Having cable is great, but make sure if you do get it, you can research your packages. Sometimes people have the cable app on their phone and sometimes they are allowed to have more than one phone or network. So if you can get with a friend who has the app, like for instance, my boyfriend has the cable app, so I just use his. Research your options, it will save you money. Number four is wasted food, particularly for like picnics and barbecues and potlucks, because it's so nice out, we wanna go, we wanna grill, spend time with our family and friends. We sometimes buy a little bit too much, not knowing how many people will be there and how much we'll need. And then we don't, you know, divvy it up at the end of the night, and then it goes and it gets wasted. The amount of food that we waste in this country is absurd. So just do your best and try to not waste as much food. And if you need to meal prep and you have a bunch of leftovers, there is your meal prep. And number five, this is a tough one. And I'm sure you'll all agree. Number five is air conditioning. We all love air conditioning. It's literally like a godsend in the summer. But for those that like to leave it on during the day when they're not there, you're literally just wasting your money. Because at the end of the month, you're gonna have you know an, an AC or electric bill that is double or triple what you normally would be paying if it wasn't so hot outside. So my tip to you is to raise the temperature a few degrees when you head out for the day and then lower it when you get home so you can enjoy it. Also keep a lookout on your you know, weather apps. If it's going to be 65 or 70 degrees at night, you can turn off your AC and open your windows if you live in a place that is safe and you're comfortable leaving your windows open at night while you are sleeping. But anyway, those are the top five money wasters. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment down below if you think there is something that should be included on this list but is not. I'm very interested to see what you guys think we waste more money on in the summer months. If you like these kind of videos, make sure to give them a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, click the little red subscription button down below. It'll update you each and every time I upload a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. It is so hot outside.